Our statements are accurate, supported by scientific research, historical evidence, or accepted knowledge. The Statue of Liberty was a gift to the United States from France and was dedicated on October 28, 1886. The world's largest coral reef system is the Great Barrier Reef, located off the coast of Queensland, Australia. A person who lives 100 years and spends 9 hours of his day asleep spends 37.5 years of his life asleep. Vatican City is the smallest country in the world. Oxford University is older than the Aztec Empire. Giraffes have the same number of neck vertebrae as humans. 7. The moon looks upside down in the southern hemisphere. Google's founders, Larry Page and Sergey Brin, originally called their search engine Backrub in 1996. The name reflected how the search engine analyzed backlinks to determine the importance of a website. Later, they changed the name to Google, which was a play on the mathematical term Google, representing a vast amount of information, which aligned with their mission for the search engine. Flamingos bend their legs at the ankle, not the knee. Their knees are actually tucked up close to their bodies and hidden by feathers. So what we see as a knee bend is actually an ankle joint flexing. Statue of Liberty surprised everyone. It actually functioned as a lighthouse for 16 years after its dedication in 1886, with its torchlight reaching 24 miles. You can see four states from Chicago's Willis Tower. Scorpions are older than trees. The earliest known scorpion fossils are around 430 million years old, while the first trees appeared roughly 360 million years ago. This means scorpions predate trees by about 70 million years. The sound of a blue whale's call can travel hundreds of kilometers underwater, making it the loudest animal on Earth. In fact, their calls can be heard by other blue whales across entire ocean basins. Although Earth is the fifth largest planet in our solar system, it is the densest. This means that for its size, Earth packs a lot of mass, which contributes to its strong gravity and the presence of a liquid outer core. There's a fruit that tastes like chocolate pudding. Native to Central and South America, the fruit is called black sapote, and it tastes like a combination of sweet custard and chocolate. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the amazing world around you.